Oh, <laughs> that's right. We're doing the joke thing. Sorry, it's been a while. Do you know what it is like having two shaman parents? They have farsight. I can't get away with anything. Wisdom does not come with age. You simply run out of stupid things to do. What's that smell? Oh, bad dog. You're annoying my dog. Uh, yeah, so those are some of my favorite voice lines when you poke the NPCs during the Oric Heritage quest line. Uh, but yeah, I just wanted to give a brief summary before the rest of the video. Here you see we talk to Etrick to start off the quest in Ogamar. Um, he sends you off to the uh, Altric Valley, where you interact with the Frost Wolves again. It's kind of cool to go back to a classic World of Warcraft zone. Um, here you talk to Thrall, Agra, his wife, and his son Durok. Um, and yeah, you start off with like doing a totem quest line. I, I will say, I really hope we get this totem back piece. As It's just a cool, it's just the orc totem uh, wet, uh, totem. But I hope it becomes a back piece one day. It was pretty cool. Um, but yeah, you kind of, the main part of the story is you kind of Duroc, um, Thrall's son basically admires you and he asks a lot of questions about the heritage of the orcs. And yeah, it was cool to kind of have him look up to you. I hope he becomes a character like Anduin, like he grows up throughout the uh, Warcraft storylines and gets older and becomes like a kind of a main character in the future, kind of like what happened to Anduin. Um, but yeah, it was kind of cool to interact with him because this is the first time I think we've seen him older. I, uh, I'm not a huge war nerd, but anyways, you kind of do some quests with some spirits as well. You kind of restore a portion of Dur uh, Durator with, um, yeah, it was just kind of cool to see that, you know, you're helping out the spirits restore the land after the cataclysm. Um, and there's also, yeah, there was this apple quest where you basically help an NPC do one of the original Warcraft quests for collecting apples off trees. Or off cactuses, whoops. But uh, she dies, but, you know, you finish the quest off for her. Uh, and then I think the last part of the quest was, yes, you kill this albino or white uh, raptor. It's like the last portion of the quest. Um, but yeah, I thought the whole quest line was really cool. Um, the rest of this video will be kind of me just... You know, finishing off the quest line and um, showing off the heritage armor. So I hope you guys enjoy, and um, I'll see you guys in the next part. Hey guys, for this segment of the video, it's kind of like I did with the tor torn uh, totem weapon. Uh, this is the end of the orc heritage quest line, and um, it was great so far. Um, I I loved the whole story. It really, I definitely think this is the most fleshed out heritage armor quest line. At least I actually, I, I'll be honest, I haven't done every single quest heritage quest line. But of the ones I've done, it's definitely the most fleshed out. And they gave a lot of respect to all of the orcs story all the way from like Warcraft 2 and 3. It was great. Um, I liked it a lot. But anyways, this part is just kind of me getting, this is, I believe this is the last portion of the quest line. And, um... Yeah, we're going to get the set, and I'll just kind of show it off. No weapon to show off this time, but I will show off the uh, armor set. So, uh, here we go. And yeah, you can kind of see, here's my character. I'm wearing, this is the closest thing to Orc Heritage they have. Is the This is from BFA, the BFA Warfront set. I'm a Shaman, so this is the male set. It's pretty good, but I'm more, I'm definitely excited for the uh, Orc Heritage armor. So, here we go. Speak your mind. Let's finish the quest. Uh, you have successfully completed the, oh, I'm going to butcher this, Omgora, um, Omgora. Congratulations, Wegar. Now it is time for us to celebrate. You have prepared a feast for all in attendance in your honor. Go revel in the glory you have earned. Enjoy yourself. If any of these orcs get out of line, remind them why you were the one who was chosen to complete the new Right. Oh, the new right first. Oops. Enjoy the feast. May the spirit. Our champion has completed the Omgora. Let us feast in their honor. Lothar. Enjoy the feast. We're all with the boss Makar and the peons. Oh, this is cool. Got another spirits. Oh wait, there's. I'm gonna put the music a little louder. Uh, hold on. I think it's it's crazy for these heritage quests. They've definitely like brought back some old Warcraft music. At least it sounds like they have. 
What's this say? Guest of honor. A feast is being held in your honor. You may attract challengers. Okay. Here we go. Turn this stuff back on. This is cool. Oh, there's the Zeppelin. Oh. Let's see how tough you are. Come on, Wagar. Wow, I just destroyed him. And then, uh, enjoy the feast. Drink some stuff. Oh, that, oh gosh, that makes you drunk. Okay, maybe I'll, I'll skip that, because, uh, that's a little disorienting for me. Whoops. So that's why I intended to unify our clan for once. It's a bold plan that I... Does that mean you're moving to Azeroth? Hear that the future of the orcs is here. It was crazy that they literally brought back every single orc character from like literally the game. Um, you'll, in my clips, I kind of I had chats with everyone. I didn't want to. It would have taken. It wouldn't have been too long of a video if I recorded everything. Right, so you look strong. Kept up your training. Yes, you as well. That's his father, right? Leorox. I'm pretty sure that's his father. I haven't kept up with uh, all of the lore of the game, but I keep fighting. Wait, oh, whoops! Am I supposed to go over here? You look like you got skill. But his I mean... class take practice. Okay. I only accept the finest class. Crash has gone off without a hitch. I think these peons have earned a break. What do you say, Rhaegar? Are you ready for the peons to join the party? Bring it on. You ready, everyone? It's time for the peons to join the party. Okay, nice. Okay, wait, now we fight, alright. Hey! I haven't had this much to drink, don't tell me who's tell me what to do. Ah, uh, maybe I've had too much too. What am I supposed to do? I just oh I just waited boot storm. Oh wait, is he actually throwing boots? Okay. <laughs> That's interesting. Die. Give me my armor. Take a boo on wait, take a peon's What am I supposed to do? Take a peon. Where are the peons? Oh, I see them. Whoops. Oh, I, I totally I totally messed that up. I had no idea what I was doing. Oops. Oof, good brawl. Just what I expected from the champion. Oops, okay. Um I guess I won? Okay, nice. You just keep eating, I guess. Play eating playmare of has increased your movement speed. Nice. And honor. For the horn. I definitely had these chats with everyone. I did, like, go and converse with everyone. But it's crazy, like... This guy is from Outland, right? I'm pretty sure this guy was from Outland way back in the game. It's just crazy how they brought every single person back. Of course, General, as far as I'm concerned, Dad Fanner. Strength for the undead. Or your strength for the undead. Oh yeah, because Nazgrim's here. Um Yeah, it's wild. Like I might just do a quick maybe I'll do a quick just run around. Of at least characters I remember. I don't remember any of these. Oh, hold on, what's this saying? Vision if you wish, you will need more orcs of your skill. I've become used to doing things alone and I'm used to not really being welcome among the orcs. Oh yeah, this is um what's her name? Garona. Garona Half Orkin? Is that really her last name? I just remember her first name, Garona. Apparently I will consider it. Times have changed, so I remember her for sure. I don't remember her that well. Is this thing gonna can I throw this? I still have this in my bag. I'm gonna get rid of it. Um yeah, I did run around and talk to everyone. I'll eat another thing here. I'm not going to do the alcohol just because it's really disorienting for me, at least. I thought these were... Um, 
Oh, it's not your port open. This you have some brawls. I thought these guys were great. It even you can hear the dog talking. What's that smell? Oh, or the dog, dog panting. I don't know these voice lines. I'm pretty sure those are from Warcraft 3, but I'm not. Maybe not. I don't know. There's a sun. Is he saying come? anything? Hey, oh, he's saying something here. Hey, Wagar, I. I just wanted to say you did great with the uh, Omgora. I was worried about my chances when it was my. I'm worried about my chances when it's my turn, but you've shown me what it takes. I can't wait until I'm old enough to do it myself. So, um, thank you for showing me the way. Be careful out there. She seems to have warmed up to you a little. She's a little blushing, but looks at you and smiles. Thanks for being nice to Durak, Gregor. You are really nice. I do hope this character... Wow. You're amazing. I hope this character becomes, like, the next Anduin, you know, for as long as Warcraft goes on. But I do think it'd be cool if, uh... You know, he becomes the war chief of the Horde at some point. You know, Thrall's son. It's just a cool Look, name. Tom. You have done well. Oh yeah, I forgot. Seraphine. You know, when he when we did the quest line, there was a bunch of messages for characters. Let me do this, okay? So well this met. is Thrall. Oh, I forgot about that. I do want to listen to these, so you have done well, Rhaegar. I have not seen the orc so happy about the future since we liberated the internment camps. Others are now lining up to complete the Umgra themselves. Umgora themselves. But they are fools if they think they will go before me. I will be the second orc to complete it. And in a few years, Durek will be old enough as well. He is very excited. Seraphine has a message for you. Let us soften. What was his message? Oh, wow, voice acted. <laughs> I am glad you did too, old friend. That's cool. Wow, yeah, they gave so much love to this quest line. Like, even with voice lines, it's crazy. For Azeroth. So yeah, before I do that, let me just... Oh gosh, okay. I didn't plan for this part to take so long, but uh... I just wanted to make sure, like... I forget who he wanted me to send the message to. I think one was for him, right? Maybe? Why have you come? Huh? Let's talk again soon. Look out. Um, Agra? No. Etrix's faith in you was not both misplaced. You have demonstrated to all what a successful Omgra should be. And it appears you have also made fans out there, both of my children. They will surely wish to follow the path of a, of the shaman after your performance. Go with honor. Oh yeah, because I'm a shaman. Anyone up here? I'll just do this. I'll try to do this quick. Farewell, strength and honor. Best seen the house. Strength, Throbo. I could have sworn. Besides Throbo, I definitely wanted to talk to someone else. Oh gosh. I might fast, uh, maybe I won't fast forward this part. Let's see here. I just know with me, like, you know, this part, I definitely want to show off the armor, but maybe some people want to see Blood and thunder. me talking oh. to everybody <laughs> or talking Steve to friend. people. Horde's got a lot of mouths to feed and I'm the one stuck feeding them. Yeah, Strength. I I feel that. I did catering back in the day. Not what fun. You need. Yeah, I've seen that before. No, no I could have sworn he wanted to talk to someone else too. Blood and thunder. Oh yeah, of course Mancrick's here. Strength. Oh. Let's make this party more interesting. Yeah, it's great to see Mancrick still doing well. I know he misses his wife, but uh, maybe... Is this his daughter? I think that's his daughter, right? Glory to the Horde. Yeah. Farewell. Oh, Rhaegar. That's... I actually named my character after him. Ah, the Orc of the Hour. Thromecraw Farseer. The spirits tell me of certain... You are certain to exceed in your... I already did. I know that they speak true. Um, you have proven your might to the Earth and Wing time and time again. True. Over me. Um, My artisans are the best on Azeroth. It's a good brawl. If you want to give me another round, you'll need to give me a minute to catch my breath. Oh man, am I am I gonna goof here? 
So this is why you were new. Uh, this is dumb talking about. I don't think there was anyone else. Okay, I'm just gonna like complete the quest now. I could have sworn there was maybe one other person that he what wanted to mean? talk to. Be safe. But I honestly can't remember. So if there was oh Rexcar? Rexcar, was it maybe him? Or Rexar? Jeez, I can't say his name. Come come to check with us, Swagar. Well, my father's decided uh decided he is speaking to me. It's a start. So I never realized he had father issues, but I don't know much of the lore with him, unfortunately. Oh, and you can pet you can pet uh, his pet Bisha. That's cool. Um, Speak, friend. Strength. Okay, well maybe it was just Thrall. I'm just gonna finish the quest now. I think you guys have uh, enjoyed this part long enough. Here we go. Eat. Okay, come on. All right. This was such a good... Okay, there we go. Complete. I want my armor set. Wait, was Thrall... Okay, I guess Thrall was always over here. Rom -com. Yes, I think it's time we draw the celebration to a close. There is so much... There is such a thing as parting too hard. Together. That's not true. Alright, I just wanted... My, like... I just want to make sure I didn't miss it. Was it just Thrall? I think it was. Yes. Oh, e trig. Okay, it was e trig. Here we go. Okay. Woo. I'm glad I went to check. I think it was just these two. So I'll do e trig as well. He's the one that started us on this quest. It warms my heart for so many of us to be together again and not to march off to war. Starfang has a message for you. Goodbye. Only in death would he admit it. I miss him too, Etrick. I miss yes. him too. You'll probably you know see him I'm soon. Sorry. I mean, you're a pretty old man. <laughs> He's been around since the original from Classic Y, I believe. And he was old back then. Um, okay, I that's that makes me feel so much better. He wanted to talk to Thrall and Etrick. Whew. I mean, it was just a little, little cut, you know, a little voice acting. But you know, I don't know. I don't think I'll probably doing. Maybe I'll do this quest again again someday, but. Not for a while. Well met. All right, complete. Let honor guide your path. Here we go. Um, this is it. All right, the Kosh Kosh Harg has been a great success, and no small part thanks to you, Lagar. Thanks. All that's left is for Agra to perform the ceremony to bring the festival to an official close. I wish to speak to the crowd before we all disperse again. And some things long overdue in, in being said. Observe the formal closing of the Kashgara. The following will be cast upon you. Heritage armor. Heritage of Draenor. That's interesting. Um, unlock the pyramids of the Heritage of Draenor in completion of the Orc Heritage storyline. And then you'll also receive the clan banner. Adds this toy to your box. Wear this banner of your chosen Orc clan. Races Orc. Back banner earned for completing the Ulkamar for your chosen clan. Um, yeah. Cool. Alright, this is it. And I believe there's like a little cutscene with this. Oh, so know. here we go. Let's listen in. Thank you all for honoring us with your presence here. When our people came to Azeroth from Draenor, ours was not an easy road. And along the way, Many of our ancient traditions were lost. But the time has come to yeah, remember look at us. the rights of old and to build new traditions that honor our proud legacy. This champion Screenshot. is the first to complete the new rite of Amgora. Yeah, that looks cool Let too. Their footsteps be followed for generations to come. Loktar. Lotar Ogar. And so we bring the first co 
Bashar of Azeroth to an end. May the honored ancestors watch over us all. Oh wow, that's the cool. They brought him back, like even for this part. That's cool. Very cool, very cool. Definitely, the, I think, the best heritage quest line they've made. I haven't done the human one yet. I, I don't have a human character, so I'd have to make one, but... Oh. Very, very cool. Did they say stuff now? I think this is all the same dialogue. I'm not going to read all of this. Yeah, I think nothing of here is new. Maybe this stuff? Speak your mind. Etrix faith in you. Okay, yeah, I think this is all. Okay, yeah, nothing new here. I thought sometimes after a quest Together, it's new. We are strong. A new age has dawned for our people, Wagar. I could never have imagined uh, bringing you in on my old fool's crusade. Wait, let me say it read again. I could have never have imagined bringing you in on my old fool's crusade would have led to this moment. Um. We have this armor specially made just for you. You have more you have more than earned it. Hail Wagar, champion of the orcs. Here we go. Stay strong. Hail Wagar, champion of the orcs. Thank you. Thank you. I'll uh salute. Hail Say anything Wagar. else? It warms my heart. Nope, that's all the same. So there we go. So there's the toy. Adds this toy, and I'll I'll check this one out. Set to favorite. Oh gosh, did I uh oh, I shouldn't have done that. Clan. Oh wait. The cargo has officially come to a close. Soon the orcs will disperse from Razor Hill. 27 minutes. Oh, bummer. Okay, yeah, I guess that makes sense. They'll all disperse. Um, and then, yeah, you can see this is the banner. I definitely chose the... I picked the Frost Wolf, as you can see, because... Uh, again, the light here. Uh, because I'm a shaman, I just feel like, you know, literally, I, I summon wolves. Hello, peons running right past me, and I transform into a wolf. Oh, wow, it even, it even appears in your Frost Wolf form. Oh, dang, that's cool. I wasn't even... But this is why, because I would only transform into a wolf and have wolves, so I thought it made sense. Um, so I, I picked the Frost Wolves when I did the quest line. Um, very cool banner, but actually, I'll leave it on for a sec. But what's now the most important part you guys probably want to see is the uh, armor. So, uh, where is it? Uh... Wow, that's so weird that it's so far back here. Anyway, okay. Let's do the first one. Um, first one's called... They're all called the Heritage... Okay, not, there's not like specific ones. But it's very similar to the Makar Orcs, where they basically have a red one, which is Warsong. You can kind of see here. Man, look at that. That looks so good. Uh... I love the I love the wolf shoulder. That's basically you know that's a skull of a wolf. I'm pretty sure. Um, my favorite color is the blue one. Well, we, I'm gonna look at them all, but uh, I will say the one thing I would never have is this back piece. I I actually think it looks better without the back piece. Let me uh, turn that off really quick. I think it looks better without the back piece because you can kind of see your um you have like a you know like a wolf pelt on your back. Um, looks so good. Look at that. I love it. I I will say like, don't get me wrong. I actually uh, I had a Mac. I have a Minecar Orc, and I think this is better just because it's newer. It has more 3D assets on it, and I also think the um, oh, just showing all this. I'm just gonna turn off the shoulders for a sec. Actually, can I do that? No, let's do that for now. I will say what's really nice about this is like I love this chest piece. You literally get to wear like a you can see like the um, hands here. You get like a wolf pelt. You can see the little claw there, like a 3D asset wolf pelt. I think that's amazing. Um, I can almost see this better like if you take off the helmet. Um, 
I can almost just see that this being a pretty good set. You kind of look like Thrall. Well, uh, sort of. Well, like his previous set. Uh, yeah, because he wears Doogram's, uh, what is, Doomhammer's? He wears Doomhammer's set again, but before he kind of looked like this, right? Where he just had like a pelt over his back. I think that's just a cool shaman aesthetic. Um, but anyways, let's try the other colors. This is the Warsung color. Um, let's do, I'll do the, I'll do the blue asks. That's probably what I'm going to do. So that's the, here's the red. You can kind of see, so the red has like a higher, like a lighter silver or not silver. The metals, it's like a white metal, dark. And then kind of bluish. Well, let's do the black one. This is the uh, black hand. Or not black hand. What is it? Oh gosh. It's uh. Why am I blinking? It's um. Black rock, not black hand. Black rock. Jeez. Um, this is the black rock one. I do like. I like the spikes on the black rock one. I like that the like. There's like a little bit of a flame you know because the black rock kind of i think that's cool um yeah that looks great i'm actually curious so yeah let me turn off the uh let's do the same thing um turn off the back piece here and let's turn off the shoulders and the helmet just for now actually i can kind of see Nah, that's, that looks weird. Let me just turn that off. Okay. See, I think this is a cool aesthetic. Now, what's cool about this one is you, the pelt has like little patches of red on it. That's neat. I actually think that's pretty cool too. You got the nipple. Of course, everyone, everyone complains about the nipple uh, spike. I don't know. I think it's cool. It's just a spike. I don't. I mean, I guess it's over his nipple, but I mean, they don't even have nipples, so. Um, yeah, this is the Black Rock one. Very cool. Um, I definitely like, like I said on my other video, I'm a very aesthetic. I think Black Rock looks cool for like warriors. I think like black and red is a cool warrior aesthetic. Um, if you do the full, uh, like I just think, yeah, I think, uh, let's go back to that. I think this is like a perfect like war. I think just these are good colors for a warrior. Um, yeah. And then, let's go to, and I think, or the red one. Actually, I think War Song would look good in it, too. I can definitely see. Let's do the blue one. Let's do the Frost Wolves. I'll do the full set first. And, you know, this one definitely matches my, this back piece thing. Um. Oh, wow, I just noticed your hair piece kind of clips through it. Let me turn that off. Goodbye. Um, yeah, I love the 3D assets to it. I definitely think this one's my favorite. Just because, like I said, Shaman, Frost Wolves. I turn into like a white ghost wolf, you know. I just think it kind of aesthetically matches. I, I You know, I'm going to use them all probably, but this is just my favorite one. But let's turn off that, let's turn off this back thing again. I will probably, yeah, I just think, see, I just think it looks much better without the back piece. Let me, uh, I'll just undo that. So you can see it, it kind of like, see it kind of clips into the pants. So I would do that for sure. Let me just see that. Yeah, see that looks great. I love the 3D asset of the bottom piece. It kind of flaps or moves with you. Um, Yeah, to me, I'll be honest, to me this is just a better version of the Magikar Orc one. <laughs> At least to me. Which is, you know, it makes sense. Magikar Orc set was made five years ago, so it's just newer. Um, let's see here. I'll do the same thing before. I'll turn the helmet off. Do the shoulder, turn the shoulders off. Yeah, like that. See, I, yeah, I think this is a cool aesthetic. Um, the white wolf skin over you. Kind of look like a miniature thrall. But yeah, this is, uh, I just kind of wanted to show off all the sets. I actually think I would do this. Let me do one other thing here. Um, go back to the shoulders. I would almost do this. Oops, let me... Uh, 
do that and that because I, th I think the shoulder piece is way too big at least that skull one like this i think this is a cool aesthetic but um yeah anyways uh i'm super happy to get this and uh yeah, let me know if you guys um, maybe I'll make, maybe I'll make a poll on my YouTube post about like what was your favorite, not just looks, but like what was your favorite heritage quest line? Because I think this is my favorite. I'm a I'm a and don't get me wrong, I'm a Torin fan. Like that's my favorite race in the game, but it was definitely a lot shorter. It wasn't. It was more just about Bane and his father. It wasn't like this. Just like had every basically everything an orc would want in a heritage armor quest, and I feel like this one had. Um, and that, yeah, or which which color do you like the best? But I definitely like the blue one. I just think white and blue is just a cool aesthetic, at least for sh uh, uh, orc shaman. Um, but yeah, um, I'm super excited to have this. And uh, yeah, let me know your thoughts. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Give me a like um, if you want to see more of this. I'm definitely like I just do the more fun collecting aesthetic stuff. But yeah, this was awesome, and um, I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next one. See you later.